what I'm doing, a lot of you guys may think is just downright crazy, but I'm going from Oakland to downtown San Francisco. You know, I'm biking from here to the BART session, getting on BART, taking it to San Francisco, and then going from San Francisco to Redwood City on the train. Now, I'm going all the way to Redwood City to buy this little part because I did this repair and, you know, the, we couldn't get the fingerprint sensor to work. And I was, you know, working on the, the phone for like, you know, three hours and the customer had to go and, you know, basically we needed to reschedule. And it was hard for me to get a hold, to, a hold of the customer because the customer was in and out of town too. This was around the holidays. And then the customer got back in town and then now I'm out of town. So now I have to go get this little part. I think it costs like 10 bucks or 15 bucks. I have to go buy that part, then go meet the customer, install it. And I'm only gonna get 25 bucks, which 25 bucks is, is not bad. But since I have to go do the commute to meet the customer, because the customer's been waiting a really long time. So I'm gonna have to like like do it all today. I can buy the part, meet the customer, install it, do it all today. And since I'm doing that all today, it's gonna take me like, I don't know, maybe four or five hours to get the whole thing done with all the commuting. And then commuting in the city to meet her. And then, yeah, so. Off I go. Also, know a lot of people want to know how come I don't make eye crack vlogs, and the only reason why I don't make eye crack vlogs is it's pretty simple. I'm just not that busy with eye crack. Um, eye crack goes by radius, and since I live in Oakland, like I get more requests from Oakland, and Oakland has few fewer requests. And there's also a lot of techs that live in Oakland. And another thing about the radius feature, like if you live in the city, like you're gonna wake up in the city, like your phone's gonna be in the city. So in the morning time, I feel that there's a lot of requests with iCrack and people in the city get those requests. Now, by the time I make it to the city, it's around, um, it's around eight o'clock, nine o'clock, meaning that people who are already in the city are already they already have those requests that came in at seven because they're the closest like in the radius meaning that you know that they get first dibs so that's why I don't really do it and it's not really that it hasn't been that busy because there's a lot more text now too before when I first started with iCrack like it was really busy because it wasn't that many texts now there's quite a few texts in the area and people also travel from other places and they'll do repairs in San Francisco. That's like a really big thing. Um, a lot of times I'll go out and do warranty repair and they'll say, oh yeah, the tech was it from out of town. Like he lived in, you know, Iowa or Minnesota or somewhere like, and it's like, wow, you know, maybe he just happened to be in the city and you know, just whipped out his app and did repairs or something like that. That's really the reason why I don't just make blogs about iCrack for the most part. All right, so that's train number one. So now I'll wait for number two, and then we'll take Caltrain. Now Caltrain, um, it's about 30 miles south, and yeah, it's gonna take, there's a bullet train, it's not actually a bullet train. It just, um, I mean, it's the same train as the other trains, but they just don't stop at as many stops. So it's like much faster. I think I'll have enough time to jump on one of those. That'll get me there a lot faster. It'll be about 30 minutes versus 50 minutes. That's the next adventure now. I'm uh, so out of breath because I had to run up the steps with the bike. Escalators are down. Bummer. I totally missed that train. Not a big deal because there's another train coming in like 30 minutes. So I think I'm gonna go to Safeway. 
maybe a turkey sandwich because there's like the only decent thing around here in this area so i'll see what i find let's go on an adventure in safeway almost there time to get off the train Just got off the train, not so fast. I got maybe a 15 minute bike ride, then I can pick up the part. The $10 part, by the way. So I got that part, right here. San Francisco done with the whole train thing now and I got another problem on my hands look it's raining but check this out it's not the worst rain in the world because it's not really sticking that much like I'm still pretty dry right now and I've been riding for quite a bit for some reason I bet Postmates is really busy right now you only need a little bit of rain for Postmates to like turn on the blitz pricing and guess what, I'm actually not doing Postmates right now. Wish I was, wish I brought rain gear. Like this morning I totally looked at the weather and I just didn't bring rain gear. I was crossing my fingers, maybe it won't rain, but guess what, it's raining and I'm getting wet right now. Bummer. Totally got my iPad in my backpack. No um, plastic bag or anything. Hope it doesn't get wet. I had an appointment with the customer. Come to find out, I called the customer, was unable to get a hold of the customer, so now I'm waiting for customer support to give me the customer's number, or I'm waiting on the customer to email me back. Look like the repair will not happen until tomorrow, and I will definitely pick up on the blog tomorrow.